everybody, I am Neharika and I'm back with a new grammar lesson for you here. Uh, we are going to learn about the confusing verb pairs that is borrow and lend. Okay, so people really get confused between these two words uh, because they mean similar but they are used in a different manner. Okay, so we're going to look at the word borrow, what exactly borrow means. Okay, now borrow is basically when you take something from someone. Okay? Okay, when you when you need something you ask for it okay you ask permission and uh, of course uh, you are gonna return it back okay so with the expectation that you're gonna return it back so here you take something from someone okay whereas lend lend is the giving act okay you give something to someone all right maybe an object maybe something or even uh, if you lend money okay so that's a more like a loan it's a commercial loan or it's a bank loan okay so here it's the giving act all right so we're going to look at a uh, couple of sentences here, okay, here you would understand what exactly the difference is between these two words. So can I borrow your car? Now maybe I don't have a car, okay, and my mom does and I have a plan to go out uh, for shopping with my friends, okay. So I need a car, right, to go to sh for shopping, I need a car, so I'm going to go ask my mother for a car. So hence I am borrowing the car from her. So how would I ask her is, can I borrow your car, okay, so this is where I am saying that I want to take the car from you okay so of course now it is my mom's car so I'm gonna of course return it right I'm just using it on temporary basis just because I'm going out so that's when I ask can I borrow your car all right so if I ask this to my mom and if you have to use the word lend my mom would say when my, my mom will say I will lend you my car okay because she is giving it okay and she knows that my daughter would return the car to me, right? So that's when she says, yes, I will lend my car, okay? Now we have another sentence for you here. I need to borrow some money for shopping, okay? Now here you borrowed your mom's car and here you need some money, okay? Maybe you've spent all your salary and you don't have any money for shopping. So again, you would borrow it from your mom. You would take it, so you need money, you're gonna ask your mom for some money, okay? So that's when you would use, I need to borrow some money for shopping. So borrow again, here it means that you're taking money from her, okay? Now if she has to use the word lend, okay, how she would use it? Maybe mom is really angry, she doesn't like uh, you shopping a lot, okay? So she would say, I can't afford to lend you any money. Okay, so that's where she means that she doesn't want to give any money, okay? So it's the act of giving. So that's why she used the word lend, okay? So I hope you got the difference here. We would look at another sentence. I borrowed a book from Lisa, okay? Now borrowed is the past and past participle of the word borrow. Okay, so here she borrowed a book from Lisa. So uh, of course with the intention that she would give it back. Okay, she would give it back to Lisa later. Once she finish, re finishes reading it, she would return it to her. So that's why uh, this sentence says, I borrowed a book from Lisa. So I have taken the book from Lisa. Okay, so try, if you are a little confused when to use the word borrow, just try substituting this word with take, okay? So we would look at the word lend here. Lisa lent me a book, okay? So now Lisa has given the book to me, all right? So that's why she's used the word lent. Now lent is the past and past participle of the word lent, okay? So here we use Lisa lent me a book, okay? So she knows with the expectation that she would, I would return the book to her. Okay, so I hope you got this difference. Uh, now we also lend money, okay? Now you would come across people uh, saying, uh, 
loan me money okay now loan me money is not correct okay you do not say that um, loan is basically the noun okay it is used for the amount that you have taken or the amount that you have borrowed okay maybe from a bank or maybe from some commercial institute okay so that's so we do not say that loan me money you would always say that lend me money okay you would always use the word lend right now there's another way that we use the word lend also uh, for example uh, now there are many people who would say um, can i lend your dress okay here is an example for you so can i lend your dress does this sound correct to you no right try substituting the word lend with the word give okay so how would you read it out can i give your dress that's incorrect isn't it so the right way is can i borrow your dress or if you want to use the word lend then you would ask can can you lend me your dress okay so here you're asking okay so can you lend me your dress because here you are the giver okay you are the person who would be giving me the dress isn't it that's exactly the reason why we are using the word lend here so can you lend me your dress okay so i hope you understood how we use these words the word borrow and the word lend so the next time you use it you would try substituting it with the words take and give, okay, and you will get it right. I'm sure about it, okay? So I will be back with a new lesson for you. Till then, you please write in to us. I'll be glad to assist you with all your queries, and I will see you in your next class. You take care and have a good day.